That's the second part of this video. And to be honest, I'm, I'm not bothered. Like, lot, not many people follows my videos, and I don't give a toss. I just do it for like you know for the sake of it. Uh, there's few guys like you know I follow them and they follow me back, and you know who you are. Um, I forgot your username. The guy who's got the Lake Tank, you know who you are. Bought Java Moss. We had a chat and everything. So it's you, the young fella, and uh, some other guys as well. And uh, this is the update. What it is. Um, the plan is I'm going to have uh, Severums, got Jack Timsies, obviously these are small, I'm getting some Jack Timsies pairs, don't know when they come in, supposed to get some Gia Vegas Brazilensis in, um, what else is coming, or some um, electric blue Jack Timsies, but that's going to take about a month because uh, the guy who's got the blue electric jam deck see he's got a few pairs but they just you know gonna start this i think so they lay egged so he wants to keep them for a while till the fries are a bit grown like you know so he wants to keep them got like the, the adults can guard the fries and then he's gonna sell it off but we don't know what's going on because to be honest these days it's hard to get hold of people that can they stay on their word i'm supposed to have yesterday i'm supposed to have someone bring me um four pairs of uh, red spot sevens and uh, he he, asked, uh, he just didn't bother to let me know that it's not coming so he didn't come so you, you have all this trouble um so see how it goes what i'm doing at the moment with this tank i'll give you i'll explain you what it is i'm keeping this as my display tank that's why it's got all this if i start if i'm doing breeding then what's the point having all these rocks and everything now the main essential is to have this as a display tank so whatever is i'm going to breed and whatever i'm going to have i'm going to have like you know the ones not breeding for me like in a smaller species and stuff like that I'm gonna go in this tank and when you know when people are coming to pick my stuff from when i start breeding and everything um they want to see that you know you actually look after your fish and you have a good setup because i've i've been to breeders okay i know this video is getting long but i'll just explain some i've been to breeders house and you go and see it and you just think what the hell why are they just like you know keeping it like that and what it is, is for them it's just money they just want money and they're not going to clean the system they leave the fish leave the fish in a poor water condition and everything and this is something that you know i don't want to do so that's why I'm having on my, as I've shown you on the water system, on the utility room, that I'm going to have my auto water system, like an you know, auto water change and stuff like that. If I can work it around, if not even, is I could do a water change, which is going to take me, what, more than, uh, not more than 10 minutes, because I've got the drain system there, it's going to go, all I'm just going to do, swap the pipe around, come to, rather than from the summit, it's just going to be going out and the new water is going to be pumped in and I can regulate because I've got the hot water tap and I can regulate it with the hot water mix of with the cold water so the temperature won't be high when I'm dropping it in. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry guys, monk. <coughs> so as I said, it's going to work out good and um, I might get some, I know they're not South Americans, but I might get some from Tulsa's uh, the only reason the front is because uh, uh, they got some demands and other Malawis and stuff like that. You know what? I see them people are just selling up for a pound, two fifty, three pound, four pound, and they doesn't have any market value. Uh, I'll give you a quick example. One of my mate um, who went to a pet shop today with me because he wanted to buy some fish and he's asked me, "Am I selling some uh, any fish?" I said, "Not at this moment." So he went because he liked all the fish that I had. So he bought, if you could see these tiger Oscars that, you know, they're growing big now. He bought smaller than these tiger Oscars and he paid £10 each. He bought two for £20. They knocked £1 off, so he paid £19, so it's £9.50. And I bought these for £2.50. Okay, and the same size what he bought. My vines are growing now because I'm feeding them hefty lot of like you know diets and stuff like that. And he bought these Jack Dempsey's from that store. I paid them two pound per fish, but I got it on an offer where he's done a deal with me. Um, I bought 14. One of them died. 
I paid him only twenty pounds, so it's supposed to be a lot. So he's just done it overall, like you know, a discount for me. And he paid a bit smaller than them. I, I, I've got a few small ones at the back, and it's one of slight like, smaller one, smaller than this one. I'll give you the example or that one. And he paid five pound each, so you could see the difference. Now, there there is a market, you know, to make money. Um, an opportunity and as I said I'm buying the equipment for cheap I bought this 100 gallon tank with a stand from one of my friends for 100, 100 pound um, what is that that's about $150 you can't complain for that and the two foot tanks I've got a few coming uh, from this another breeder who old man uh, who had a heart attack recently god bless him you know he should be awkward now and he stopped doing breeding and so he's got all these equipment there so he's selling this off so my mate bought some and i'm getting some of that guy and these were paid what 10 15 pounds i think it's a 15 pound each uh for two uh what do you call it? Uh, two foot tanks which is two foot 12 foot 12 foot good enough for the fries and the four foot tank i got a four foot one of them bigger one I got one of them uh, someone wants to sell it for 20 quid it's, it's not advertised or anything it's one of them someone that I know he wants 20 quid for it um, I might just grab them so as I said all together what it's gonna cost me to set up everything maybe about 300 pound uh, with that 300 pound I'm just taking a gamble if it works out it works out if it doesn't work out I'm just losing 300 pound but there will be no harm to the fish because I know what I'm doing with the fish and I know you know at least how to you know look after them and when I see there's a threat like you know something like that I'll just get rid of it I've had the tiger oscars in that tank with the um, jack dempsey's or oh, they getting along so nicely I've never seen the oscar picking or the jack dempsey picking on the oscars absolutely good uh, so that I'm happy I don't want them to fight just for the sake of like you know I'm gonna start breeding and I'm just gonna put some fish with something that is not gonna relate to it or it's gonna have problem I'm not gonna do that uh, I'm just gonna maintain the way I can keep it and the, see you guys I'll do video it's gonna take a slow process to do videos because at the moment I'm really busy with all this stuff and uh, let me know what you think let me think let me know what you think of my ideas should I do it? I, I, well, I'm going to do it, but if you give me ideas, like, you know, yeah, there are some fish, like, you know, it's really hard to get hold of in UK, but, yeah, you still can get around them. Let me know some South American cichlids that, you know, you think, yeah, they're really rare, and if you can get hold of it, you can do something about it. Yeah, let me know, and have a look at it on, like, you know, Google, search it on Google, and advertise it on, like, you know, classified, if anyone's got some pairs, uh, I'll pay good money for it. So, guys, this is as I said. Um, I've wasted your about twenty minutes. Well, thanks for that. Your time is much appreciated. See you later, guys. Leave a comment. I really appreciate about your comments, and I like it. See you later, guys. Have a good time. Bye.